Hello, Joy. Thank you for being with me today. Hello. Thank you. You have an amazing gift, a desire to sing, to praise the Lord. And you were just telling me a little bit about your story. Um, but this is something that's been with you ever since you were younger. You wanted to sing to God, correct? Yes. I mean, we're created to worship God. The that's chief right. end of men is to worship God. That's why mm -hmm. we're here, to bring Him glory. And and you had this desire, and you you strove to be the best singer that you could ever be, right? But that something happened. You kind of pushed yourself too far, didn't you? Indeed, yes. I took that striving for perfectionism too too deeply. Uh -huh. And what did you do to yourself? Well, when I was little, I wanted to worship God just as I saw all the adults doing. Mm -hmm. And I'd sing along with the radio, but... I couldn't really hear the notes the same way as everyone else, so I'd mm -hmm. sing off key. I had had no vocal lessons. Mm -hmm. I had no way to control my voice, and people would just get down on me. And um, so in future, um, in order to protect someone from ever being mean to my voice or my worshiping again, mm -hmm. I purposely vocal abuse my voice, like I just push myself to limits, I'd mm -hmm. go past things I shouldn't have, I'd practice too long trying to earn men's approval, mm. just... So the opinion, and this is sad because the opinion of man hurts us sometimes, the mm -hmm. cruel things that people can do, their words, they don't know how much it really hurts us. People may say sticks and stones <laughs> may break my bones, but words will never hurt me, that's not true. Words, words hurt you, and, and that that just made you push yourself harder than was natural, and, and you damaged your voice. Right. That was permanent. That It was a permanent it, damage. Correct. The physical part, it became a raspiness. Even mm -hmm. if other people could not hear it, I heard it. Oh, wow. I call it scar. I called it scars in the back of my throat. I believe they were there, like, yeah. It just... I'm pretty sure I had vocal nodules at least twice. I had like wow. every, just about every symptom you could think of. Mm -hmm. So I didn't know what this was. And, and that hurt you. I'm sure it hurt you emotionally because this was your dream. This is what you wanted to do. Um, well, but God obviously did something amazing for you. Otherwise, you wouldn't be here in front of me. What do you do? How did God change your life? Right. So when I first came to see FNI, mm -hmm. um, I, I had had a bad dream one night in the hotel before I came to school, and mm -hmm. it was about the vocal cords, the yeah. back where it was hurting. And then one day, the professors were talking about how they would help their vocal students like find their identity, uncover their identity of the voice God gave them. Yeah. And I thought that was really interesting and I thought, huh, God, it would be really nice to have my old my old voice back. Mm -hmm. Because before when I was a kid, I hated my voice so much that mm. I covered it. Like I changed the tone and the yeah. sound of it. I did not like that sound either, so I covered again. Mm. So there were two covers resting on my natural voice. But God <laughs> when I was in chapel and just praising God. Mm -hmm. I felt something shift. And like just I felt my old voice come back, like the voice I had when I was like fourth or fifth grade. Wow. The childish voice came back. Yeah. And I'm um, praising God and over time, well, I guess I should say first that that night the healing of like just the emotional healing came yeah. all in like that night or the three days. Wow. And then over the week, he took that childish voice and matured it into a young lady's voice. Oh, wow. He, you, you he just, accelerated the healing. He did a restorative miracle to you. Right. And also during that time of maturing my voice, he also like took away the fear that someone's listening to this new voice. Yeah. So I'm no longer so afraid. See, I find this amazing because God knows the desire of your heart. He placed yeah. that in you to begin with. But obviously you needed to mature, and, and he knew how important it was to you, but man will always try to beat us down. And so in that moment where you finally surrendered to him, he gave you back what you needed. And it was what he originally gave you to begin with. So you, you were trying to push for something 
that you thought uh, was the way through man, but, but God gave you what you needed, and, and he accelerated you to a level of where you needed to be in your voice today, correct? Correct. I, wow. I found my female identity in those high notes that I had before. I was prideful in those high notes, mm -hmm. but God's teaching me that I'm his daughter. It doesn't matter about those high notes. Yeah. The, the important thing is to worship God. Yeah. It's not those high notes. I mean, th those were nice, but... You had to find your identity in Him. Right. I, right. I was so dependent on my own, my own merit, yeah. my own skills. Well, that's, that's a emotional healing and a physical healing. And, right. and God does everything across the board. He heals, delivers, and sets free body, soul, and spirit. And, and thank you, Lord, the work He's done in your life, Joy. Thank you for being with me today. Yes, thank you. I came because I just learned that testimonies, they can be prophecy too. They, testimonies right. have power. They do. Someone out there needs to know that they need to use the voice that You're God right. gave them. So this could be testimony, prophecy to them. And they can, and they can receive that just by the same way you did and, and you encouraged that and you you spoken into existence and that is prophecy because right. you've spoken into being right and, it, and it, whoever it is we may never know but god knows and that's why right. he had you here today it's the blood of jesus that did it that's all. right that's right would thank not you, be here without the blood of jesus thank you julie yes thank you